Hi, and welcome to Dandy Things. I'm Dandy, and this time around, I went for a Kate Spade-inspired decor theme. I wanted to still keep it simple and stylish. I thought about the combination of stripes, polka dots, and I knew I had to give this a shot. Not to mention the beautiful clean bows Kate Spade has. But let's start with my living room. Since my color palette is black, green, and gold, I kept my pillow decor very simple by only using this black and white faux fur pillows and the black velvet pillows as well. And my coffee table, I did just a touch of whimsy with this doggy and this snow globe that actually has gold glitter instead of snow. And I definitely could never go without candles. For my console table, I got this art piece that has interlocking squares on top of each other. And I just thought it gave it a beautiful dimension I saw it and I knew it would go great anywhere. For the tablescape look, I found this Kate Spade runner and I knew this green would be ideal. Buying only the salad plates gave me a chance to incorporate my already owned black and white dishes. Now, if you're wondering about the white ceramic chargers, they are actually serving platters. So here's another quick tip for all you tablescape lovers. The fact that this color in the runner is bright and in the middle of my table, I didn't need much of a centerpiece, so I kept it minimal by just adding two candle holders with these two black candles. On my buffet table, I kept my decor with raw elements by simply using this gold, long curled branches and bringing in this cute reindeer in the midst of it. I thought it was enough charm. Moving along to the mantle and Christmas tree, I used this planner with a bit of greenery and this black vase in the other side so that the black yarn wreath wouldn't look too harsh to the eye since it's the only black item in here and balancing things out. The same applies to these two nutcrackers that measure the same and are put side by side. The Christmas tree was a bit of a challenge to do but I kept it minimal by simply using the items that inspire me to do this look. Stripes, polka dots, and bows. What else can a girl ask for? Using bigger size ornaments lets me get away with not having to use so many. Plus, I love the minimal look. Therefore, by simply adding nothing but white stem branches and gold antlers, I gave it glam and spunk at the same time without having to add tons of stuff. And at the very end, the cute bows gave it that perfect finished look I was looking for. Well, there you have it. My Kate Spath inspired decor. I hope you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe for more upcoming videos. Thanks for watching and have a jolly Merry Christmas.